Okay. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending with where you're watching this video from. My name is Victor and I'd just like to take this opportunity to welcome you to my YouTube channel. If you're a new subscriber, I would like to encourage you to subscribe so that you're able to see the future videos that I make on the same. And if you're a returning subscriber, I'd just like to thank you. Kindly take time to like this video, to share it, to comment, and I'll be glad to respond to your query. So today I will be tackling this problem set zero from CS50 introduction to programming with Python. And before I proceed, I would just like to give a disclaimer that this video is strictly for educational purposes only cheating or any other activity that violates academic honesty guidelines is strictly discouraged the problem set and presented in this video is owned by harvard university so i will open the question prompt it's this one titled in the voice and you can see it's titled in the voice writing in all caps is like yelling best to use your indo voice sometimes writing entirely in lowercase in a file called indo implement a program in python that prompts the user for input and then outputs the same input in lowercase punctuation and word space should be outputted and changed you are welcome but not required to prompt the user explicitly as by passing a string of your own as an argument to input so we are going to proceed and implement this like i said earlier i love using pycharm so the first thing that i'm going to do i'm going to declare i'm going to clear this default text so one of the things that the prompt ask us in a file called indo implement a program that prompts a user for an input so what you are going to do is that what you are going to do is that we are going to ask so it's going to prompt eh? it's going to prompt a user to enter a message like that then this program this prompt again says then it's supposed to output the same in lowercase punctuation and word space should be outputted and changed you are welcome but not required to prompt the user explicitly as by passing a string of your own as an argument to input so we are going to come up with a variable we are, come, we are going to come up with a variable and name it message so this variable we are going now to use the input function this input function will prompt the user to enter the message then we are going to write here enter the users enter the enter the users this is help you that enter the users message if that should work enter the users message and then we can put the full column in that then the prompt asks us to ensure that the output that we get should be in lowercase so to implement that we can just say message equals to message then we are going to use this lower this lower function and the message equally white space should be outputted so we are going again to use the we are going to use the strip function as well so dot strip like that then we are going now to print the message 
So we can run this and see whether it works. So enter the user's message. Let us put it in caps. Hello. How are you doing? Hello, how are you doing? So you can see that the program has actually converted our input into lowercase. So the program works fine. So thank you for taking time. Kindly watch for the second video.